everyone, it's Angela again. I have something super exciting to show you today. Um, if you have been following me on Facebook, you know that I made a post a few weeks ago. I don't know how long it's, whatever, um, about the Indigo set that you can order. Well, I have one now and I would like to show it to you because it's awesome and this one's mine but you can order your own it comes in a big ziploc bag and it has this pretty sleeve that goes on the front of the box and the butterflies are cut out just to make it really pretty and then this is the box that the bars are in. Now, just in case you didn't see any of my posts about Indigo, um, Heidi and Orville, which are the CEO and the owners of Sensi, the wonderful, wonderful bosses ever, um, Heidi decided to come up with a six pack of bars, not in the catalog that reflect around the color indigo. So they're different shades of blue, different scents of blue, I guess you could say. Um, and this is the very first one. If it's successful, we'll hopefully get more um, collections for different colors. But I had to get this one because blue is my favorite color and I love butterflies. So, this is the box that it comes in. And the back has um, the descriptions and everything about the bars. So let me open the box for you so you can see at the top of the flap it has the descriptions and the names of all the six bars that are in this package. You get a scented little card. This one is scented with indigo cotton. And then you get another little slip of paper that has the scents, but they're in a different language, which I think is French. I don't speak any other fluent languages except one and I'm not going to say any of those words on here. Ugh, so silly. But here is what they look like. Let's see. And I will take them out and show them to you. But each one starting from this side, it starts out with a lighter shade of blue and then it goes darker. So let me set this down and I will tell you the names and the descriptions and if you want to smell them contact me you can smell mine but I'm not making samples of this because these are mine and I want to keep them the first one is indigo cotton it has a very pretty light blue butterfly on it and it is a very light, almost a powdery blue color. The description for this is chambray on a clothesline, breezy, breezy, clean, serene. And it does have a very nice, clean scent. So, the top notes are morning mist, lemon zest, pink grapefruit. The heart notes are blue lotus, muduet, <laughs> honeydew melon, and the base notes are white musk, soft amber, and silken timber. That's the first one, indigo cotton. Sorry for my doggy bark, can she hear somebody outside? The next one is called Indigo Ice, and 
it is a darker blue, almost, can't really, I don't know if you can tell the color, a little bit darker than the last one. Indigo Ice, and this one says it's a wintry landscape, chilled, woodsy, invigorating. And when I smell this one, let me get over here, you can't see me, sorry. When I smell this one, I think of a man scent. Like, when your man or any man that you walk by smells really, really good, this is what that reminds me of. It's not a stinky man scent, it's a good man scent. According to me, that's what I think it smells like, a man's cologne. But not perfumey, just, just really nice. And the description, I don't know if I read the description, so I'll say it again because I'm brain dead today. The wintry landscape, chilled, woodsy, invigorating. I think I did say that. But the top notes are juniper berries, sea salt air, bergamot zest. The heart notes are cedar leaf, violet leaves, crushed lavender. And the base notes are blue mayo wood, cashmere musk, and rich amber. And that's Indigo Ice. The next one we have is Indigo Petals. And it's, like I said, they get darker blue as they go. And this one, I'll read the description first, then I'll tell you what I think it smells like, because otherwise I'm going to get confused. A crown of flowers, fresh vibrant and playful it's flowery but it's not super flowery I'm not a big fan of flowery perfumey scents so this one I would probably warm this if I was going to warm these bars I would probably warm this one because it's a light perfumey it's not like give you a headache perfumey type thing Okay, so the top notes in this are sea mist, grapefruit zest, chilled tangerine. The heart notes are violet leaves, indigo blossom, and cyclamen petals. I don't know what that is, but they must smell good because this smells awesome. The base notes are sheer amber, vetiver, and tonka bean. I wish you guys, wish we had smell of vision because this smells nice nice clean scent too okay the next one is indigo spirit and each butterfly is also different if you haven't noticed that this one is kind of a purpley blue <sighs> mm. this description is Violet petals on whipped meringue, rich, creamy, and indulgent. Mm. And the top notes in this indigo spirit are elderberry, blueberry, I knew I smelled blueberry, peach nectar. The heart notes are violet petals, damask plum, an apple blossom. The base notes are whipped sugar, vanilla cream, and tonka bean. Now I can smell the whipped part. The whipped cream, sugar, and I can smell the blueberries now that I've read the description. This is nice. I like it. No, I love it. I love them all, but this is a nice scent. And I wouldn't lie to you, if it didn't, there are some scents that I do not care for, but every nose is different, so there's always a scent for someone. This one is Indigo Berries. There's the color of it. And, oh, this one is probably my favorite out of the whole box. There's one more to go, but this one is probably my favorite. 
It is sun ripened sugared berries sweet tart bright. The top notes are lemon zest, sweet orange, and big nayberry. Must smell good. I don't know what that is. Okay. The heart notes are rhubarb, jasmine petals, and strawberry. Strawberry. Maybe I do smell strawberry. Base notes. Cotton candy. Mmm. Sheer musk and vanilla bean. This one, like I said, is probably my favorite one out of all of them so far. There's one more to go, but I think this one's it. Because it has a scent of my most favorite scent ever that is now discontinued, and I'm so very sad. If you guys have ever smelled Buckleberry... Yes, I've had this bar and I will not melt it because I can't get it anymore and I just love to smell it. It's definitely not as strong as that, but it has a very similar smell to it. And I think that might be why I like it so much. So, that is Indigo Berries. Last but not least, we have Midnight Indigo. It's the darkest blue of them all. If yeah, I always tell the color because some people buy their wax by color and smell. And that's fine. However you want to do it. Whew. And this one is described as an expansive starry sky, sultry, intoxicating, and mysterious. <laughs> Oh, I like this one too. This one has the top notes of salt air, sea mist, and lemon zest. The heart notes are bergamot leaves, jasmine petals, and white cyclamen. I hope I'm saying that right. And the base notes are soft musk, coconut milk, and blue cotton. Now this one reminds me of a current scent we have in our spring and summer catalog southern evening that's what to me it smells similar to that not quite the same but it has a similarity to me that smells like southern evening oh i like it so i could smell these all day but that was all six of the indigo bars that you can get now they are $30 because they come in this beautiful box. It has scented things in it as well as the six bars. So, if you would like to order one, let me know and I will hook you up. They're $30, but I did just find this out. I just had a party and my hostess wanted to know if she could get one of these with her host rewards. And yes, you can. She only paid $10 for her box because she used her host rewards. So, you can use your Scentsy host rewards if you have a party that qualifies at least $200. So, if you don't have the money to buy one as any product that you like, you can host a party with me and get it for half off or free. The reason she got hers for $10 was because she had $20 free that she hadn't used yet. So she used the $20 free and paid $10. You can split those up however you want, most of the time. So anyways, if you would like to have one, let me know and I will put an order in for you. $30 plus tax. Thank you for watching and I will talk to you next time. Bye.